All right, hello everybody. Welcome back to another live stream. This one I'm going to be playing and kind of showing some gameplay from my recently launched game from Friday. Uh, Cap Fixed. Colors are pretty, fish is gross, cake is delicious. Perhaps the longest name for a game on Steam yet. I'm not sure. Anyway, guys, this game is, you know, if you look at the gameplay trailer here, a lot of people might think, oh, you just remade Rock and Roll. It looks like your first game, Zax. Uh, no, this game is way different than Rock and Roll. Plays completely different. Uh, and this game's all about scoring combinations, smashing through these rocks, uh, and getting the cake, which is worth a bunch of points. Cake does make you fat in the game. You will get bigger and slower and much less uh, responsive and have less maneuverability when your size is, uh, you know, two, three hundred percent because you've eaten a bunch of cake. Uh, but just like real life, you can work the size off. You can slim down by moving around. So move around more and your size will go down. You've got to make sure that you eat some kind of cake, though, especially if you last a while on a level, because if you get down to 20 percent size, uh, you will die. So you've got to make sure you don't starve to death. This game comes in at only $1.99 uh, regular price, guys. You can get it right now for 20% off at $1.59. Or you can, if you don't have any of my games, you can also score a pretty good deal. Get yourself a bundle for under $9 that would get you all three of my games and save you a couple of dollars. So we're going to go ahead and play this game a little bit. I just added a new, uh, I did have a high score where it uploads your high score to Steam. But now I just added a, uh, a new deal where it'll upload your best... Uh, smash combo so you've got to get smash you got to smash asteroids in succession to score a combo so it'll be kind of interesting to see what people you know what their highest combination can be so far mine is six but I haven't played the game much myself how you doing Matthew what's going on dude welcome to the stream so let's go ahead and play I tried to do this last night but uh, my internet went to crap and uh, I couldn't really stream so here we are all right, do we got sound? We do, okay. Let me turn the sound down a little bit. I'm gonna be a A little bit loud. All right, so when you uh, launch the game, so when you launch the game or when you die, uh, it's gonna tell you press space to spawn a ship. You gotta make sure your cursor is in a clear location. You don't wanna spawn right in an asteroid because guess what, you'll die. Um, oh, how you doing, Pokemaster? Welcome back. So you wanna make sure your cursor is in a clear location, hit space, you'll spawn your ship. And as you can see right here, guys, your ship is always gonna face whatever direction your cursor is. So just spin your ship around. It's as simply as moving your cursor around. Avoid everything you can. Uh, obviously, the faster you clear a level, you're going to get bonus points for that. But to, sh to uh, kill fish, guys, you want to make sure your ship is the same color. WASD changes the uh, color of your ship. So I know that by playing that A is blue. We're going to change to blue, shoot those fish. I got them both in one shot because they were in the same spot. Now, I can either shoot asteroids by changing my ship to the opposite color, like that. I want to go green here, shoot the fish. So you shoot fish, you got to be the same color to shoot the fish, and you've got to be opposite colors to shoot the asteroids. So we got to be red, for example, to shoot a green asteroid. Now you can also change to the opposite color and crash through the asteroids. Now as you destroy asteroids, or vectoroids as I call them in the game, uh, you will earn the ability or the probability of cake spawning. Once cake spawns, there's a zero probability and you have to earn more cake by clearing out vectorates. Cake is worth a ton of points. For one piece of cake, it's uh, worth quite a bit. It goes up as you increase in level as well. But let's go ahead and show you the crashing through. You just got to build up speed and you can smash through an asteroid and then make sure you change the opposite color. Smash through a two times combo and a three times combo, and I'll get some points up here for that. Right now you see zero smasher points, but I got 120, it just came in. And it shows you how many points you got for everything after the level, your level bonus, your size bonus for how big I was, etc., etc. 
So we're gonna go ahead and uh, space to spawn again. And I'm gonna go ahead and blast this guy. I'm going to crash through this guy. I'm gonna turn green. I'm gonna crash through this guy. Go blue. Oh, wrong color, Demi. Okay, let's go ahead and get our cake here. Let's go ahead and shoot this fish. Go blue. There we go. Back this way. And there we go. So I think we have more Smasher points coming in. Yeah. So we got 150 Smasher points. Time bonus of 96 uh, based on how fast I cleared the level. 285 cake points for eating one piece of cake. And this is pretty much the game, guys. So after 10,000 points, you will score an extra life. Uh, after 10,000, 25,000, 50,000, and 100,000, uh, there are no extra lives after that. Oh, let's go red, get rid of this guy. So notice if I shoot an asteroid with the wrong color, uh, it won't destroy it. So if I'm green, I shoot that, it won't, it won't kill it. Oops, gotta be red, Jimmy. Come on. So another thing too is like how fast you go. So if you are going really fast and you want to slow down, simply put your cursor by your uh, ship and right mouse button to thrust. And if you want to move fast, put the cursor away, far away from your ship and thrust with the right mouse button and you'll go really fast. So again, if you're going too fast, simply put your cursor by your ship, thrust, and you'll slow down. So that's kind of how you control your ship. I think it works pretty good, but it still takes a little bit of practice to get used to. I wanna get that cake, oops. I missed it. Come on. There we go. Okay, I want to try to get all three of these in a combo. Let's see if we can do it. Nope, didn't do it. Didn't do it fast enough. Turbulent, how you doing, man? How could you miss that? How you doing, Emma? What's going on? Today's your birthday? Happy birthday, Matthew. How you doing, man? How old are you today? If you don't mind me asking. Get that cake. Notice I get bigger when I eat the cake? Ah, oh, we're going too slow. Yeah, see, it always tells you why you died. You're going too slow to smash the vector. Ve Three times combo. I'm not gonna get to four. Yeah, too slow. More cake, nice. And I just earned an extra life, that's what that sound meant. Oh no! Damn it! Stupid fish. Oh come on, I spawned right by the fish, that was my fault. He just earned 15? Oh, okay. Cool game, thanks uh, Matthew. Yeah, this game's uh, buck 59 right now on Steam, guys. If you want to support me and go get it for yourself. Boom. Come on, man. I'm doing terrible. You'll get the lines around your ship when you're going fast enough to break through an asteroid. you got to make sure you're the right color, too, though. 
Oh, man, I barely missed that. Damn it. Give me that key. I'm not really doing as good as I could be doing on Smasher Points. Welcome to stream, people. Three people here now. Guys, I am going to be doing the uh, part five of uh, an Octave Higher here soon. So be sure if you're waiting for that. I don't know how many of you guys are watching that. Replay. Fuck! That's a little bit better. 250 smash points. But as you can see, this game plays a lot differently than like Rock and Roll, for example. Oops. I keep doing that same thing. Come on. Let's get a decent smasher going here. There we go. I think I got five times. Six times. Nice. It's my best one yet. 630 points. It's my best smasher yet, guys. Best smasher combo. Time bonus 159. Cake 360. Level bonus 600. Jessica, how you doing? This one looks fun. Yeah, this one's pretty fast-paced, Emma. Um, if you guys are wanting to buy it, the link is in the description, guys. Whee! Ah! No! Oh, come on! Ah! Get away, fish! Get away! No! No! Oh, wrong color, damn it. I was yellow, not green. Fuck! So I got all your tips right here on the main screen. I'll probably end up making this look more streamlined eventually. Um, but right now, it just has your controls here, and then the tips uh, are right here. I mean, it's pretty simple. Really no options for sound or anything like that. I figure if you want to turn your sound down, you can just turn your volume down on your speakers. Um, but I might, you know, I might add some of that stuff. I didn't think I'd ever add volume and all that to Laser Ball, but I did, so... Uh, you're doing good. You just woke up. So I want to try to beat my high high uh, streak, guys. I just added, like I said, this game changed completely. I I put this game up on Steam a few weeks ago, and I just recently changed it. I decided Wednesday. The game was pretty much just shooting the Vectoroids and shooting the fish. I mean, I have the opposite colors in and all that. But I was playing my own game like Wednesday, and I'm like, you know what? And my son was playing it, and it just felt a little bit dry. It felt like I needed, because my son was like, for example, my son was just sitting in one spot shooting all the asteroids. So here's what my son was doing. My son was just like, all right, dad. And this is what my son was doing with the game. You know, he just like easily changing color. You know, I had the cake in a couple of days ago and he'd go get the cake if it appeared. But as you can see, it's like, Hey, you know, let's, uh, you know, he just sent one spot and fire away and no problem. And it was, just, it just seemed like it was a little bit dry. So it's, it was a couple of days ago, Wednesday, two days before I had to launch it. that I'm like, you know what? I really not need to try to make my game more fun. I mean, you can still sit back and sit in one spot and fire away and destroy all these, uh, rocks if you want to. But I think the fun comes now. Because Wednesday, I decided to go ahead and add the ability to crash through these Vectoroids for combos that give you a lot of points. And I do think that really added uh, quite a bit of fun to the game. I think it's a lot more fun to try to 
to crash through the Vectoroids. Obviously, it's a lot more risky. Uh, you're probably going to lose a lot more lives. But I think that's where the fun's at in this game. And I just, like I said, I didn't even put that in until... I don't even think I started working on that until Thursday. So... Too slow. Get that key. Come on, get over there. Fuck! Wrapped around. Get away, fish! Damn fish, I'm telling you. Get that cake. Oh, God. Man, I'm hating my own fish. Wee! Wee! Okay. Um. Even though yesterday I got off work early, I felt like I was working a 12 hour shift. Hey, Madden, how you doing? Uh, you won't be here for a week? Bye, uh, bye, Madden. That was quick. In and out. Madden comes in to say, I won't be here for a week, and then bye. That's funny. Damn it. Fuck! I'm doing terrible at my own game right now. I keep missing. Damn it. Let me go ahead and get this cake. Here. The cake will vanish if it stays there too long, guys, so you know. My fish are kicking my ass. How you doing, wizard man? What's going on, dude? Welcome, everybody. Welcome to stream. Boy, I suck at my own game, I'm telling you. It's because I really never sat down and actually played my game until, like, yesterday. I really haven't played my whole game a lot, so especially since I made all the changes to it a couple of days before launch. Come on. My son just walked by and said, you're bad. Got my own son mocking me for playing my own game bad. But it shows your cake probability up here when you start your level. You're going to start off with zero. You have to earn the, you have to earn your cake basically, and you do that by shooting or, or destroying asteroids. So now you see it's low. Now you see it's high. So I got a high probability for cake now. What? Oh, I was going too slow. It'll always tell you why you died. So I thought I was going fast enough to smash that asteroid. Probably just a little bit too slow. There's my cake. Yummy, give me that. I could probably score a lot more points if I would just quit trying to crash your stuff and just shoot stuff. But it's not as much fun. Whee! Look how big I am, 300%. Look how fat I am! Seven people here watching now. Welcome, everybody. How you guys all doing today? What's going on? What's going on with you guys? We. Get that key. Can I get up there and get another combo? Keep the combo alive. Oh, well, I got five. I'm telling you, when you're trying to go for these combos, you're gonna freaking die. It just happens. It's it's a lot of fun, but it's really risky. Just like that. Because the uh, rocks wrap around and you bounce off the edges, so. It makes it pretty interesting. Go blue. There we go. Three times combo, red. There we go. Blue again. Ooh, can I get the last one? Yeah, baby. 
that cake, get that cake, get that cake. Nice. Should have a combo coming in here? Yeah, 420 points on level one. That's pretty good. Now I'm warming up. Still got all five lives. Go green. Ah! I bet you some of you people out there would be a lot better at my own game than I am. Guys, if we get uh, if we get ten people, actually, let's go ahead and challenge the you guys. Get some friends in here, guys, while I'm playing this game on this stream. If you guys uh, if you guys get fifteen people here in the stream, I'll give away ten copies of this game for free. Fif we need fifteen people watching here. I'm just going to play this a little bit longer, but if we can get fifteen viewers in my stream, I will give away ten keys. I'll give you guys ten keys to my game. <laughs> Bam. Doing good here, Wizard Man. Good to see you again, man. How many of you guys have been watching my um, my recent uploads for an Octave Hire? Because we're going to be doing part five of that here pretty soon. One, two, three. Why didn't I change the right color there? Well, I got a couple of three combos. Oh, I got a six smash combo. I thought I only got a couple of three. Nice. Okay. I thought I messed it up when I died, but as long as you respawn and quickly get another combo, it'll count. Dummy. What am I doing? Why am I spawning right next to a freaking rock? Let's get the cake. No, yellow. Now red. Now shoot that guy. Now go yellow. There we go. Now go green. Get that cake. Just got an extra life. Cool. Whee! Okay. What am I doing? You need to be blue for that, Demi. Nice. Stupid fish. All right, let's see how well I can do if I just, if I play boring. Let's see how well I can do if I just, if I just sit here and shoot all the guys in contrast to uh, being risky and being a daredevil. I mean, I'm still gonna earn my cake and cake is worth a lot of points. So we're gonna quit being a daredevil guys and see how well we can do. Try to get time bonuses and cake bonuses and see how well we can do. We're not getting any smasher points, but we're going to try to maximize the other points we get here. Mm -hmm. 
Because this is really where I need to test it as well. I mean, you know, I might need to balance it. If this pays off, if playing the easy route, you know, is a lot easier, then I probably need to balance it and make the crash of your asteroids even more rewarding. Probably not nearly as much fun to watch when I play like this, though. High cake probability again. And I mean... I mean, I could just sit here and shoot an asteroid or two and then wait for the cake. Shoot an asteroid or two, wait for the cake. I still got zero probability. I want to shoot at least one more. Oops. There we go. Now see, before I shoot this last asteroid, I could wait get the cake. Look how big I am, 400%. I got 680 size bonus points for being so damn big. That was 400% size there. Things are moving big. Asteroids are moving quicker now, though. Got my extra life. Let's look at that cake. High probability for cake. We're going to wait for it. Try to maximize our points here. Where's our cake? We got a high probability. Come on, game. Give me my cake. There it is. So, I mean, you really can play however you want. You can play, you know, less risky like I'm playing now, or you can play like a daredevil trying to crash through all the rocks, score a lot more points a lot quicker. 400% size again, 720 points now. I was 400 before when I got like 600 and something, but the higher level you are, the more points you get for pretty much everything. Let's get the cake. Go blue. Shoot the fish. Go red. Get rid of all these guys. Get the cake. Over 500 points now for cake. Damn. I want to play this now, it looks super fun, but you don't have a computer? Oh no, wizard man. I'm sorry, man. Don't have a laptop or nothing, huh? That sucks. Yeah, I wish you had one, man. Pretty simple game, I mean, I've, I gotta say, I've never really seen a game like this, so I think, I think, I think my idea is pretty original. I can honestly say I've never seen a game like this. So at least my game's original. I mean, yeah, you could say it's like asteroids or, or whatever, but I think it's quite a bit different. Size bonus 760. 1,570 points for cake. Yeah, the, get, the name of the game, Cake is Delicious, uh, is definitely living up to its name. The cake is, I'm at over 30,000 points, guys, by being really safe here. So rather than trying to be a daredevil, I am, uh, I'm doing really well. Probably needs it, means I need to probably make the, I probably need to reward players more for doing the smashers. 
because you shouldn't. I don't think you should do. I don't know. Because I never scored this high when I was trying to smash through the asteroids. So I'm probably going to have to make crashing through asteroids even more rewarding. To kind of balance it out. Otherwise, there's really no point in playing, playing like a daredevil. Look how much better I'm doing by playing it safe here. This is playing a lot more boring. You should be rewarded for playing, um, playing well. I mean, playing aggressively. Live a life on the edge. Everything's moving so damn fast now, damn. I got six lives too, guys. I got 40,000 points now. And I already got six freaking lives. By being safe. One of the thoughts I had a couple of days ago was maybe making it so you can't shoot so far. So, you know, you can't be way over here shooting asteroids way over here. But I kind of like the ability to shoot really far if you need to. I think it's kind of fun to be able to Like Rock and Roll, for example, doesn't let you shoot near this far. And uh, I kind of like this in contrast to that. Another extra life. Seven lives now. Over 50,000 points. Uh, you wish you had a computer? Man, look how fast these things are going now. I'm on level 12, guys. Damn. Cake. More cake already? Goddamn. Like, at this point, I don't think you're really going to be crashing through a lot of asteroids. If you are, you're probably pretty crazy. You're probably going to be... You're probably going to need to use a combination of both smashing through stuff and, uh, you know, taking it easy. If you really want to maximize your points, you probably need to do, need to know when to kick back and when to be aggressive. Damn it. And when not to uh, spawn right in front of a fish like that. I probably am going to make smashing through asteroids a little more rewarding, though. I mean, you get a lot more points already for breaking through them. But I'm probably going to make it even more rewarding. Okay, so let, let's take a look, guys. If I if I shoot an asteroid right now, 228 points at this level. Okay, so if I crash through the asteroid, I get 372, plus I get a smasher of one times, another 75. So more than twice as many points to break through the asteroid. And then also, if you hit like three or four or five in a row, it even you know, gives you a lot more points. Uh, mm -hmm. You get a lot bigger smasher bonus. So, it's definitely already really rewarding to to do the smasher. I think you just kind of need to know when to smash through. I mean, right there with only one left on the screen, it's kind of silly not to take the smasher bonus and get, you know, an extra 525 points just for smashing through a couple of asteroids. Granted, I'm on level 12 and that helps those points, but you know, when you can, you probably want to smash the asteroids. But right now, it's probably really dangerous to try to, you know, go crazy here. So. We're going to go ahead and try to get a couple here. There's a two times combo. There's one. Damn it. Stupid fish. Let's go. So many rocks moving so fast. 
There's two, one, damn it. Stupid fish! Look how fit, fast these fish are going. I don't know that I really need to change anything, guys. I, I don't know. I mean, you already get a lot of points for smashing through them, especially if you can set up some combos. I don't think I'm gonna change it, actually. <clears throat> I just got like 50, 60,000 points, though. Yeah, I don't I don't think I really need, I think, I think I'm gonna leave it up to the players to decide how they wanna do it. I mean, breaking through asteroids is already really rewarding. And I, I really want the cake being one of the biggest rewards in the game. And if I increase Smasher anymore, then it's going to make cakes pale in comparison. And I've always kind of wanted cake to be one of the biggest rewards in the game. Obviously, cake's a lot easier to get compared to smashing through asteroids and changing your color really quick and all that. But... Can I get another one? Yeah, baby. Can I get another one? Four. Blue. Five. But then I died. More cake. You can't, uh, you can't crash through the fish, so... See here, I might as well, because if I shoot it, it's only worth whatever, 50 points or whatever, but then if I, if I crash through it, I'm going to get double the points, plus I'm going to get some smasher points as well. So right, like right now, it's silly not to crash through it. Oops, that was the wrong color though. You need to be red, Demi. Yellow is not the opposite of green. There we go. And if you guys ever, you know, want to know, hey, what's the opposite color of the green asteroid? Red, right here. What's the opposite color of the purple asteroid? Yellow. What's the opposite color of the orange asteroid? Go blue. So all your, you know, your little cheat sheets right down here. For those people that don't know their opposites well. And there I am trying to crash through a green asteroid being green. Like a nincompoop. Damn fish! Yeah, I just don't do as well, though, when I play aggressively. Four thousand points, playing, trying to play like a madman. But that is uh, Cap Fix It, guys. This game just launched a couple of days ago. The link is down in the description. If you have any questions, be sure you comment down below. I'm going to go ahead and wrap this video up, guys. Here in about, uh, what time is it? Let's see. Yeah, here guys, in about 12 minutes from now, about 1.15 my time, about 3.15 Eastern time, I'm gonna go ahead and start part five of an octave higher. If you guys haven't uh, seen that visual novel or heard it, definitely, uh, you know, maybe try to tune in for that. Uh, obviously, it's a recorded video. I did it about a year and a half ago but I will be live in the chat as I play that. But anyway, guys, if you guys want to go grab this game, the link is in the description. If uh, you're watching this video later and you have any questions or comments or suggestions, be sure you put that down in the comments. I'd love to read them. Thanks so much for watching, everybody. We'll see you soon, about 12 minutes, guys. We'll be back for an Octave Higher Part 5. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care.